This is M. And this is Ken. And this is just your typical boy meets girl. Boy and girl become BFFs. Straight up BFFs. For life. Girl asks boy to make some top five lists. Boy decides to film it. And an internet sensation was born. Dozens will be entertained. This is our podcast. Top five battle royale with cheese. With cheese. And welcome. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome to M. And Ken's. Top fives, Battle Royale. With cheese. Cheese. All right. Yeah. Today's topic. Today's topic, M got to pick. I did. One hit wonders. One we're bringing back wonders. the love. So we're, some uh, awesome. Yeah. Some cool, uh, this is a fun, this was a fun list. I actually had a lot of fun with this It was a little too. difficult, mm-hmm. but it was fun. It was. It was fun. And... Um, I'm just going to throw this right off the bat. I feel bad. Wright said Fred did not make my list. Oh. And, uh, I, um, I just feel bad. You're not going to fight for consolation no, number six? No, I feel like I you got away. You already gave him props by talking about him. So. I feel like I got away with one. Yeah. But, uh, yeah. Well, I mean, because I mentioned it last week. I want, I don't want people to be like, well, you said, Wright said Fred. I want to, off the bat. Clear it up know. now. Yeah. No Wright said Fred. Right. So if you're watching, Em and I good friends we mm-hmm. make top five lists and argue about them and we usually argue a lot because we have varying opinions we do. although we've had some uh over the past couple lists we've had some cross uh contaminations Absolutely. if you will uh i think this ones one and twos twos and ones you know i think this one might be difficult i think it would be interesting to... if we did have some of the same ones i, mean, I think we're gonna possible. have five totally original yeah, I think I, I think we'll be I think we'll be lucky if we each remember <laughs> the song. Right. I'm pretty sure you're not going to know my top five. So, anyways, the possibility. M got to pick the category, so I get Fire. to pick the topic. We have our fancy Two Face Harvey Dent coin, and Harvey Dent uh, has been on a four game losing streak. Yes, Two Face has been on a four game winning streak. I'm going to go with. Do I flip it? Uh, Harvey Dent. <laughs> Two face again! Wow, five and four. I am losing badly, and I think that, that means you are five, and I am three. I don't even know four. I don't know. We'll have to. We'll someone, put it up if right someone here. has kept track of that, this would be the place to comment we'll put, for that. If we had a producer, uh, somebody they would, would have been keeping that. We're looking set. for a producer, by the way. If you would like to be a producer, let us know. Absolutely. Or we might have hired one by now. <laughs> it's a good possibility. We'll, we'll see. Okay, yeah. so. That was a weird... That was nice segue, seemed, Ken. Let's go. That almost seemed desperate. Um, so we're going into my number five. Uh, since I lost, I get to go first. Um, it's a fun song from the, like the early 90s. Kind of that, that era of like crazy, funky, weird hip-hop songs. Okay, right. Um, I don't know if you're going to remember it. It's Paperboy, Diddy. I got nothing. Do the diddy 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 do because they see if you... Won't you just do, 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 do maybe? You if you heard the song, I think you would, familiar. I, I feel like if you heard the song, you'd remember it. It was just, it's such a catchy song, and I, I love the song. It just, um, so. They never boy, made, they, they never had another one? Paperboy, I don't think, ever had oh, any other hits, which is bad. a shame, because did, 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 if you want to, because then I could see if you want to. Just, oh, I do know that song. I'm not saying the words wrong or right at all, but, but I know like, you get the gist. I so. am. Alright, uh, <laughs> my number five is, uh, Was Not Was. Was Not Was. Well, they had a couple hits, but yeah. Walk the Dinosaur. Walk the Dinosaur. Oh, well, they had more than one hit. I yeah, I think they did. Seriously? Yeah, they had, uh, that other song. <laughs> yeah, that other song. Other than Walk the Dinosaur. I'm almost positive that Was Not Was had another song. Really? But that was, like, their big, I think, hit. So am I cheating again? Uh, no, because I don't think that they were, uh, I think the sophomore, like, the sophomore secondary hit I think is I think they're actually a pretty popular band if I'm not mistaken they might have had some hits did you say they were a popular band well I mean with people who like was not one I don't know <laughs> well, like all five of them I think this might this might require a Wikipedia search but <laughs> maybe I, so they might have had more than one hit okay well according mistaken. to me they're one hit one they did have two they hits had they the did dinosaur. they had two hits but that's okay but I love walk the dinosaur okay good so you're walk not gonna the dinosaur. Anything that involving dinosaurs. Is <laughs> I figured be that would be uh, that would be a so, hit. I do love that song. All right, fair enough. Number four. My number four is uh, from one of my favorite movies. Uh, every every uh, New Year's Eve, I watch this movie. I have done it since uh, 
we were teenagers. Uh, Dead Eye Dick, New Age Girl. Oh, okay. Mary Mo. She don't eat meat, but she sure likes the bone. Do 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 I like it. Yeah, I love I love that song. It's like I play that all the time on my MP3 player. It's yeah, Dead Eye Dick, New Age Girl. Awesomeness. Uh, my number four is uh, The Proclaimers. The Proclaimer. <laughs> you know what song it is? I, I will walk, walk 500 miles and I would walk 500 more. <laughs> okay, now you're not going to tell me they had another hit, right? They did have a hit in the Shut Shrek up. movie. They did not. They did in the first Shrek movie, the On My Way. I'm on my way. From Missouri. That was the, that was them. I don't even know that song. Second hit. It's okay, but it was nowhere near. I don't even think it was really a hit, except for me, because I've seen Shrek like a billion times. Okay. Um, but, uh, yeah, they, that's a, I love that. And the video. Because, mm. like, in the video, <laughs> like, you great. weren't sure if they were the same dude. <laughs> right. like, are these twins, <laughs> or are they the same person? And, so that's great. And please tell me that when you sing this, when this song comes on in the car, uh -huh. and you're singing, when they get to the la-da-da-da part, you pretend like two different people. Oh, absolutely. Who doesn't do that? Right. Yeah. I just want to make sure. Oh, you're I good. Make sure. You're good. All right. So I, uh, my number three was one of my first crazy ringtones on my phone. Okay. Back in the day when the phones didn't make a lot of noises. Right. They only had like three tones they that beat. you could use. Right. Uh, and it works perfectly with this song. One of the greatest hits of all time. You hate it, when, but you love it. Bunky Town, baby. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Gotta make a move to a town that's right for me. Do, 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 yeah, that would be perfect for an old school cell phone ringtone. Absolutely. I like it. Lip sync. Yeah, that's who sang Funky Town. Lip sync. They were one of the winners, so you never knew that. Lip sync. Haha. <laughs> Is it like a play on words, right? No. I don't think that might have been. I don't know. Lip sync. Lips ink. I know that, but if you run it together, I know. Like lip sync. I know. I'm mostly just mad that I never put that together. <laughs> That's really the only reason I'm fighting on this one because I just now. Right. Do, 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 do. <laughs> oh my god! All I right, have... my number three. We have abandoned ship into silliness. <laughs> we have my my number three. Da, 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 da. Right? Oh, Collaborate and listen. listen. Although he did have, what's that other one? My um. Uh, he had uh, have it a Rony or something. There's some Rony song. He also did the too. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles rap from. Oh, of course, because that ninja, was a huge ninja hit. Rap. Ninja, it was a hit. Ninja rap. The ninja rap. Oh my god. Go ninja, go ninja, go, right. go ninja. He was in the movie. He's go ninja, go ninja, go ninja, ninja rap. Whatever you say. <laughs> Vanilla Ice, Mr. Robert Van Winkle. Yeah. Yes, excellent. That's a good choice. I, I do, uh, I love Vanilla Ice. Vanilla <laughs> Ice. Uh, all right. <laughs> what show was he on? Celebrity something, something. Uh, He was, like, on, like, the first season of, like, The Surreal Life. That's it, Surreal Life, and, right. And I think that was the episode with Gary Coleman, and he pissed off Gary Coleman because he kept, like, like making jokes about his, like, height he and stuff like that. He was on Pete in a Plant or something. That wasn't Gary yeah. Coleman, was it? Gary, I don't know. Yeah, on The Surreal Life? Yes. Might have been, might have been Vanilla Ice. Who was the one, no, 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 who was the one that was on the scooter? It might not even been that se season, it might have been a different mm. season. I've only watched, like... Oh, no, I know who it was, it was Vern Troyer. Oh. <laughs> that guy's got problems. Yeah, I'm thinking so. I've met that guy, he's got problems. Seriously? Yeah, he was, I met him a couple years ago when I worked at the TV station. Mm. He hated being called Mini-Me, which... Well, I can understand I get that, that but I come know. on, man, you brought that on yourself. Yeah. So, uh, all right. So, in the 80s... Uh, my uh, next artist comes with eight. And in the 80s, they had this thing where they would name, bands would name their albums and songs after them. There were a couple. Okay. Uh, but I think the most famous is Big Country. In a big country dream, stay with you. I got nothing. Love, love, across the mountain side. Nope. Stay home. Come on. <laughs> really? <laughs> Yeah. You don't know Big Country by no. Big Country from the album Big Country? Apparently not. Oh. Sorry, sorry, and sorry. Wow. Wow. That's In a... In a big country. You know the song. I mean, I probably do. I mean, wow. Who knows? You inspire me to drink sometimes. I'm sorry. <laughs> My number two is sort of like, I squeaked him in. 
Because, I mean, technically they had more than one hit, but we all only know really one, and it really wasn't even them that was singing it. <gasps> Millie Vanilli! Right? Yes, yes, yeah. yes. That was, uh... So, I mean... Blame it all the rain. rain. It was falling, falling. Blame it all the rain. Song. Yes. Yeah, that, so, so you gotta have a million. million. Well, I don't even know what their other song was. They had another one, right? Uh, they did. It was uh, it was a faster song. Yeah. Like that was like their slow pop melody. The yeah. other one, I can't think of the name of it. I don't remember what was either. I love Millie Vanilli I love and Millie um, too. yeah, Robin Fab. Yeah, I knew that. So, yeah, yeah, really, that I was, uh, really. yeah, that was, I remember, uh, people would throw their CDs away mm -hmm. when they found out, like, people were so enraged that they weren't really singing. Oh my God. Like, it was some, Shocking. it was like the weird, like, uh, the Grammy thing, I get it. Get I get that. The Grammy, they the didn't Grammy really deserve it. But yeah. But like, throwing, or burning the albums. <laughs> Seriously. Like, really, people? Is this what we have come to in our lives that we're so outraged that they yeah. didn't actually sing. Somebody was singing, and you liked the song. So does it really matter? Hang on to it. Yeah. Does it really, really matter if they had attractive people uh, on stage pretending, to be, pretending to be singing while they had some weird, funky-looking guy in the back? Do we even know what those people look like? Can yeah, they sh they showed a couple years ago. Really? Yeah. And he was like older. Really? He was like an old dude, and I think it was only like one person. And they was just one guy singing twice. Yeah, I think they just That's like awesome. the, 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 yeah. <laughs> we never picked up on the fact that he sounded the both of them sound exactly the same. Interesting. All right. Yeah. So, my number one is a love song. And I know okay. that's probably surprising to everybody, especially those of us who watched our Things Not to Say to <laughs> Women episode. But my first, uh, my number one song is, uh, is a love song. It's one of the best love songs of all time, really. Okay. Uh, it's one of the best songs of the 90s. Mr. Big, Be With You. I'm the one who wants to be with you. Yeah, it's good. I like that. Deep inside, I hope. You feel it too. Okay, can I just tell you that it takes me back to like the roller skating rink? Greens. Right? Yeah, I did roller skate, but yes. Okay, right. Right about that time in our lives. Roller skating. Yep. Backward skate, couple skate only. Yeah. Mm hmm. Was yep. a skater. It's alright, it's cool. Yeah. It's cool. But yeah, I, I would like sit it. and eat nachos uh, <laughs> and watching other people skate. skate when this came on. Because apparently they would make us go to skating. Like, why, why did everybody have to go to the skating, to the skating rink when we had the skating parties in school? It was a social event. Yeah, it, was, but, it was like the dance for elementary school. Kids. Yeah, but if you don't want to go, you, why should I? Why did I? Why was I forced to go every year? Who, who forced you to go? Like, they made. They forced me to go. It was an after school event. No, they were always during school. Oh, ours were always after school. Oh, see, I went oh. to a really crappy school district. It just made that you let go. Us, we went on we went on some field trips. That's yeah. terrible. Right? It was the worst. I think from like fourth grade, like third grade on to like sixth grade. Okay. We went every year. Did you go and on educational field trips? We went to a rock show. Where did you go to school? I know like, where you went to a school. Rock and where did you gem, a rock and gem show. Oh, not like a not rock a, not like a rock concert, like a rock you, and gem you show. You see why I was confused, yeah. right? No, okay. I, I realized after I said that. All right, right. We went to a, a rock, rock and gem, and gem show, show. And we traveled to this rock and gem show in cars drove, okay. driven by parents. Oh, yeah, that's it. And our, uh, my friend Jerry, her dad drove us. Okay. And he stopped to get gas, and we all got popped. So we showed so up. Awesome. We showed up and at the rock, rock and show, gym show with pop, and nobody else had it. Like no, nobody else from our group had it. Like, That's awesome. I think it was like third grade. I still remember that because it was just like the most BA field trip. And when is that ever going to happen again? Never. It, like people would be outraged if they heard that people are kids cars. were traveling oh, yeah. in other people's cars. Oh yeah. It was the eighties. They did not care. Well, because about they wouldn't have they wouldn't have booster seats for all of you in the car. When we started on all that, but yeah. So yeah, Mr. Big, be with you. That's I awesome. love that song. Uh, I love in the video when when they're playing and like that part in the, the in the video where like the the song goes boom 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 on the bass drum right. and the guitar player like kicked the bass. It was yeah, it was pretty cool. And I remember my friend Doug was the only one. My friend Doug and I were the only ones who knew the lyrics of the one part. Okay. It was like waiting down a line of greens and blues, uh -huh. and nobody really knew what that line was. They were like, sure. so. I remember being cool because we knew that line. Mm -hmm. Glory days. Yeah, glory days. All right, oh, okay, so I, I probably should have done a little more research about my number one. I feel just like... Just to make sure. <laughs> I feel like everybody on your list is okay. not technically so, a one-hit wonder. The one thing you have to know about me, okay, is that I... Yeah. Obviously do not own uh, a computer that goes... <laughs> well, no, yes, I know, right? But we, 
Hi, that's cheating. You can't Wikipedia one hit wonders and steal from there. Well, you can verify your your. Uh... That's what we have a producer for. We don't have a producer. Oh right. Okay. <laughs> anyway, I um my I I am hoping that my one is a one hit wonder. I pick Sir Mix a lot with uh. No, Sir Mix a lot is a one hit wonder. Pink butts in a can, nah, nah. You all of us can't nah. nah. And we're girl watching with Amy wasting running in your face. You get sprung. Okay, good. So I did pick. No, that is a classic. I love it. That is a classic one hit wonder. Unless you count the Burger King commercial. Well, you're did. counting Shrek with uh, for the SpongeBob. Did whatever. you see the SpongeBob Burger King commercial? I like square pants. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. I mean, but that wasn't it. I got gotcha. you. Uh, that now that's I think that's your only legitimate one hit wonder. Okay. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. But, but I mean, most <laughs> none, none of these had multiple hits. Okay, so good. So we're good. Uh, so yeah. So maybe, maybe two. <sighs> that enough. is a good list. I like that. was fun. I like that. And one. I will have at least ninety percent of these songs stuck in my head for the next. I, I was thinking that exact same thing, but good luck. Have, uh, have fun having whatever stuck in your head. Stuck I in have head. Uh, karaoke that song. Who hasn't? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my jam and karaoke. I, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna overstate it, but I rock it. It's good. It's good. <laughs> so that's our lists. Uh, this was a weird episode. <laughs> but it was fun. It was fun. This was a fun episode. So these are our top five. Wait, uh, did you just call it weird? It was weird. I didn't say it looks weird. I said it's... Okay. Don't get... Don't get mad. <laughs> don't be hating. All right. So anyways, uh, this is just got awkward. Uh, leave us your comments. Uh, what Sounds did you think of our list? Who do you thought was better? Who was not as good? Uh, uh, Sir Mix You can visit. Well, okay, you nailed it with Sir Mix a lot. Right. Uh, even though you, you know. Anyways, I'm, I'm uh, cheated. Facebook, Twitter, right here. Visit, friend us, like us, love us, follow us, share us. Uh, every week, Wednesdays, we will be here sharing our lists. Uh, so tune in next week. You got to pick. I picked. So it's your turn. And You're so up, it's my friend. My turn. And I feel like because I picked the. The girly girl love song. I feel okay. like I need to man it up Gotta a bit. Man it up. Let's go with our favorite sports teams. Oh, that's good. Sports. Sports teams. It was, it's manly. Sports. Um, is this where we pretend that we're not, like, the biggest nerds on the planet? I think uh, the last two episodes when we debated <laughs> uh, comic books <laughs> so uh, have heavy. pretty much uh, nailed that one. Right, so, cool. Sports next week. Tune sports. in. We will see you then. We'll be here. Pouco só deu pra comprar o pedal a roda e um banco pra citar. Mas quando tá bom a peça, vou devagarinho quando tô.